hey everybody and welcome back to our channel in today's video we are going to show you how to embed a diagram from Droyo in notion let's begin now the first thing that you need to do is to log in using your credentials if this is the first time in notion i want you to click the sign up option and from here just follow the on-screen instructions and you're good to go Embedding a diagram from Droyo going to Notion is a simple process that can be done in multiple ways. That is helpful, especially if you are using both tools for productivity, collaboration, or documentation. So in my case, I've been working with a specific diagram that I wanted to embed directly to Notion. So um, for now, I'm going to click the file and I'm going to upload an image from the device because I wanted to add more interactivity here. Now, once the file has been added, you see there are multiple ways for you to embed going to Notion. Number one option is going to be exporting the diagram as an image. All right. So go to the file section. I want you to click on save for now, control plus S, so that the latest update will be saved. And once it's uh, done, click the uh, export as option. So you have multiple options to choose from. All right. So PNG jpeg web psv and a lot more but for now i'm gonna be sticking to the png you have an, a lot of options here you can choose the selection only or maybe just choose the diagram you can choose from a transparent background or a dark background whichever you prefer you can add in the shadow and grid and you can include a copy of your diagram all pages are current page and then click the export button what will happen is it will be forwarded here and again you have multiple options to save this not only to your computer or to your local machine, you can only also save it to your Google Drive, OneDrive, Dropbox, Git, GitHub, and GitLab. All right. So in my case, I'm going to be choosing the my computer. Once it's downloaded, I want you to quickly switch to your Notion account. Once you have loaded your Notion account, I want you to click the create button on the upper left corner. Now we're going to add more information here. For example this and add an icon add a cover if you want click this and then click the change cover and of course you can use the upload button click the uh, upload file and search for the uh, diagram that you have exported in Droyo so th this is going to be the diagram and it takes a little while depending on the complexity of your file so the more more information it has it's going to be a, a lot so you can reposition the diagram that you want, for example, this, right? And click the save position, all right? And then another option is click the plus button here. You can add basically and embed the image. Again, you see you have the option from the embed link right here. We're going to, we're going to do this later, the embed link, right? But for now, we're going to click the upload button. And then there's going to be the embedded image from Droyo going to Notion. All right. Now, the next option is we're going to use the embed option here. You see that there's going to be an embed link, right? I want you to quickly switch over again to your Droyo account. And here in Droyo, I want you to click the file section. There should be an option that says embed. Now, we're going to use, you can use any of the following embed as an image, all right? Click the embed button. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to delete some of the... Uh, so that's the reason why. We're going to remove some of the elements. And again, I told you earlier that it depends really on the complexity of your diagram. So we're going to zoom it out so we can see. We'll, we're going to remove some of the unwanted uh, elements. Now let's try to click the embed options. Hopefully it'll work this time. Embed as an image. Click embed. All right, so it's not happening. All right, how about we dismiss this one right here and click the embed button. Hopefully it'll work. All right, so click the uh, copy embed switch over to your notion from here add the image use the embedded link click that click the embed image 
it takes a little while. Again, it depends on the complexity of your diagram, all right? But normally, this is the easiest way for you to embed the diagram from Droyo in Notion, all right? So it takes a little while, really, depending on the complexity. Make sure that your computer is capable of handling multiple tasks, like here. Let's click on wait. So I'll get back to you once it's done. Now, another option that you can take into is here. Go back to the uh, Droyo platform. And here, go to the file option on the upper left corner. Click the section that says publish. Click that and you will be forwarded to the link. All right. And again, it requires an authorization. You can also use the public URL of the diagram. Diagram is not public. If you do that, click the click and it click the create button. And again, this is going to be the uh, public link we're in. You have an option to embed this through email through Twitter, if you click the preview button, it would be forwarded here, but you need to authorize the Google Drive, right? If you click the authorize button, then just um, follow the on-screen instructions, right? Click on continue. You would be able to preview the embedded link for that specific diagram that you wanted, all right? And then click on escape, go back again here, Copy that generated link and again, go back to your Notion. Now here, go to the uh, editor. All right. Type in forward slash. Click the embed. You see that? You have an option for embedding. So if, this is another way for you to embed here in Notion. All I have to do is click the paste button. Click the embed link. And this embeds the diagram as a link source, though it won't display on in line. All right, click on the embed button. Again, it takes a little while because embedding diagrams and notions ensures all your project information is stored in one place. You don't have to switch between apps to access diagrams and related notes or tasks. All right, because diagrams like flowcharts, UML, and mind maps enhances the understanding, especially for complex ideas or processes that are harder to convey with the text alone. Now, from here, you might want to click the share button. If you want to share this to your client, maybe uh, put their email or your group here, especially if you're working with multiple freelancers, this is going to be helpful. All right. Because Notion is a collaborative workspace and embedding a device or, I mean, a diagram from Droyo allows the teams to view the diagram in context. Even if the diagram isn't editable directly in Notion, it gives you, your client, your team members access to visual resources while discussing or editing related content. And that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you again in the next one.